So how are we playing? How do we start this? Ryan Vera is a little rusty on his pinball, but Ethan Hoffman can show him how it's done. Okay. And Ryan's got something else for him to try. I brought you a racing simulator. A new addition to the games room here at the Ronald McDonald House. It's my first time I ever did this. Is yeah? this the horn? No, there's no horns in racing. No, we just got to drive past them. But first, they've got to rig up something so this five-year-old's feet can reach the pedals. We're going to get you taller in two seconds. Watch out for your finger. All right, we're set. We go as fast as we can. A quest that's a huge part of Ryan's life. He's a professional racer. Nowhere to train at home in Calgary. Here he is behind the wheel on the Indy track in Toronto. Okay, you're on the pedal. Leaving town this weekend to hit the circuit in South America. I've got to go to Brazil and race for Canada. Donating the simulator he's trained on for years to the Ronald McDonald House. You kids are some of the bravest kids I've ever met in my life. You guys gave me a lot of inspiration to get in the car and race. This is my way of kind of giving back. It's pretty neat, bud. Go so fast, eh? Ethan's dad, Tyler, has been bringing his family here a lot over the past couple of years, getting treatment for Ethan's little sister's heart condition. This is awesome. Any little bit here helps. It takes the kids away from what they're dealing with. And whether you're on the track or on the simulator, the fundamentals stay the same. We need to find our cars and pass them. We do need to find some cars to pass. Oh, turn right, turn right, turn right. There you go. Shift, shift up. Right here. Fast and Furious. You're pretty good at this. Bill Tucker, Global News.